Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to use a GDB debugger to compile your C program. Suppose here in my terminal I have a program that calculates the greatest of the two numbers and the product of the two numbers. Suppose if I want to compile this program using a GDB debugger, I'm going to show you how to insert a breakpoint in this program. So this is my C program that calculates the greatest of the two numbers and the product of the two number. So what I'm going to do out here is I'm going to insert a breakpoint in line number 19 and line number 22. So to compile this program using the GDB debugger the command is gcc minus g g for GDB debugger minus o the name of the executable great the name of the C file that you want to compile okay so if there is no error you will come to the second line now to use the gdb debugger you have to type gdb and the name of the executable the name of the executable out here is grid so you type grid so after that you will get a bunch of line out here regarding the gdb debugger and uh, you when you go to the next last line you will see this prompt out here so this tells you that your gdb is running properly and now you are in a GDB you are inside a GDB so now to insert a breakpoint what we'll do is we will use the command B B for breakpoint the line number where we want to insert the breakpoint so in a program we want to insert the breakpoint at line number 19 and one more breakpoint at line number 22 okay so now we have inserted two breakpoints at line number 19 and line number 22 now we will go ahead and run this program. To run the program, we will just type R and press enter. And to prompt for two numbers, just type the two numbers, say any two numbers, 5 and 7. So now, after printing the 19th line, the program has paused. So now, to see the value of, to see what's stored in D, you can simply print out you can simply type this command print p it will show you what is the value that is stored in d at this moment so here it is 7 so when you click c it will continue and go to the next breakpoint so now we are at breakpoint number 22 so again here also we can see what is the value of d at this point so when I do print D, now the value of D has changed from 7 to 35. So this 35 is the product of 7 and 5. Now when I press continue, the program runs and terminates. So to come out of the GDB, you just press Q. Now you, you are outside of the GDB debugger. So this was the program to show you how to use a GDB debugger to insert a breakpoint in your program. Thank you for watching the tutorial.